I'm in Sausalito, California, just north of downtown San Francisco and the Golden Gate Bridge. And in this quaint, beautiful marina town, it's all about the water. People work on the water, people live on the water, people also work out on the water. Slide your left foot in. So why not practice yoga on the water? This floating yoga studio requires specially designed stand-up paddle boards. I'll tell you, when I first heard yoga on a board, on the water, I was a little intimidated. I encourage people who say, I think I'm gonna start taking yoga to start on the board and then take your practice inside. The movement of the board helps them to get where they wanna be into the poses. It's time for me to paddle out and strike a pose. This is Joe, everybody. Hey guys. <laughs> you don't have to know how to paddle board or even be a long time yogi to take a class. Are you wet? I'm wet, but I'm all right. Even beginners like me find their balance. I felt very comfortable in terms of sturdiness. I didn't feel like it was going to be rocking one side to the other. Why is that? It's a lot different than a regular surfboard. The bottom's flat. We made them wider so they were more stable. Yoga is one of those sports that it's not only good for your body, but it's also good for your mind. It's you becoming one with the water, and that's, that's kind of the metaphor to life is go with the flow. Go with the flow even if you are drifting away from the class, right? Correct. <laughs>